we will always be and continue to be the rebels of the watch industry. So we will continue to challenge the status quo. We will continue to challenge everything uh, and uh, to bring uh, new ideas uh, to birth that, of course, maybe a big brand or the mastodons out there, they cannot afford because, you know, they cannot you know, change so drastically how, how we can, can do that. And, uh, and this is basically the main mission. Innovate, innovate and innovate. And one theme that uh, it's very close to my heart and because it's also something that was uh, uh, um, very present from the, be the beginning is the word motion. You know, this year, the theme in 2017, we are people in motion. Motion in two aspects. Motions because it's an attitude as a brand. You have always to look forward. You have always to move always you, otherwise and innovate, otherwise you die. And motion also because it's related to the movement, you know, the mechanical movement, the heart beating. So kinetic, you know, the art, kinetic art. And uh, these two things, of course, will certainly, not certainly, will guide the future of the development of uh, of Lens. You have to be clear of what you want. You know, you have to be clear on, on, on how you want to be perceived as a brand. And the brand of Lens is, of course, first and foremost, the product. And to be this, you know, to distinguish yourself from the others, you need to have a very, very clear guiding line. You know, consistency, it's, uh, we say in French is a maître mot, uh, especially in luxury business. Uh, you know, you cannot change from one day to another just because, oh, the trend is going this direction. Okay, let's do it. No, that's a short-term view. Uh, and yet we are here to, uh, to exist. Hopefully, I don't know, that's a big dream. I, will not, I won't be there <laughs> to, to, to recall that. But, you know, one of the years from now, Outland is still existing. Why? Because, you know, they, they could... Innovate. They could have. I mean, they could develop their own identity. They had success with it, and uh, uh, with consistency, uh, they created longevity and basically uh, to create a product that lasts forever. Outlands, being you know one of the first brands to uh, uh, to bring contemporary watchmaking, high-end contemporary watchmaking, to this level, it was time to uh, reshake the tree. Uh, and uh, to bring something completely new. Uh, we will continue, of course, to do beautiful watches, but um, uh, our feeling and, uh, of course, our philosophy, our mission is to con continue to innovate. And we thought about, of course, time. You know, everybody is, is, is saying we want to master time. But at the end of the day, nobody can master time. You know, we can only embellish time. And uh, this is basically the mission we have since, uh, since now 13 years. And uh, we thought, why should a wrist be exclusively, exclusively reserved for a watch? Why not have something completely different? And why not have basically a mechanical game uh, to play and to enjoy time? And uh, basically to have um, a, uh, a connection to time that is completely different. You know, we are living in a world where, where everything is connected. Let's sometimes take the time to disconnect and enjoy the time. I mean, we have an, two other big projects that are today under embargo. So we are just presenting, you know, off record uh, during SHH uh, that these two projects, will, they will be released after SHH between SHH and Baselworld. One of these projects, without mentioning, of course, the details, because we want to keep a bit the secret and uh, and tease uh, and tease uh, uh, the market is that we um, continue to develop our concept d'exception pieces. Uh, so the HL2 family, the Vortex family, and uh, we have now, I would say, the logical step of the movement. I'm not going to tell you what, but it's something incredibly nice to see. Uh, you know, we are into art. We are into uh, creating art pieces, and you will definitely enjoy. The, the evolution of this movement with an incredible complication. The second one is not directly related to uh, the movement itself. It's related to a new material. It's a new combination of material. So it's going to be a world premiere. This has never been done, done before. And uh, this will be 
presented within the Vortex family.